My name's Hayden Francis, owner of Predator Jiu Jitsu Academy. Right, so look, we're gonna grab the material right here and over here. And we're gonna pull him down. Good grip, you got him strong. All right, then we gotta trap something. We gotta use our foot for something. You remember what? Yes, good. All right, now, Brady, which way are we gonna go? Oh, don't let go, hang on to him. Hang on to the, his arm. Hang on to the key, nice and tight. And now, yep, you lift your legs. Lift your bum. Good. All the way up to your knees. Use your hands now to push yourself up. Hey, good job. And hands on him. Hands on him. Excellent. Are you organized for your class? Yeah, this is the writing for the track. I feel like that's too much. Pick my arm. I'm controlling it. Boom. I'm getting ready to bridge. I trap her foot. I bridge and she catches herself. From here, I'm just letting the tricep go and I'm reaching up towards the head and I'm using my head. Again, when I do this, guys, I have to be past her elbow. Otherwise, if I'm like here, she'll be able to drag her arm back across. So I'm bringing my head high and I'm reaching. And then I'm gonna walk my feet to the other side. Step, bridge. When we get on top, make sure that you guys posture up nice and tall. Any questions? So today we've been just working on uh, getting ready for the next competition. somebody a lot bigger than me then I'm probably gonna end up on bottom for at least a portion of the match <laughs> two-point crew I know, I know. I, I freaking apparently some of those guys are pretty big so I'm not sure how that two-point crew is gonna that two points gonna be a sweep is what it is <laughs> a few times before I don't have a count on how many though is, is it there the potential for you to compete against black belts at this tournament I do believe there's a couple black belts registered in the pro division <laughs> once a week when I was in Montreal, maybe. Uh, but I, it doesn't really count. I was just doing judo on the mats with jiu-jitsu guys. So I feel like the real jiu-jitsu training started here a year and a half ago. One of the big reasons that I shifted to jiu-jitsu was that it gave me an outlet to keep grappling uh, and to keep a kind of more open rule set than what judo was developing into. Uh, with judo not allowing leg grabs and kind of restricting gripping and all that kind of stuff. It was a little bit limited and I wanted to keep grappling and do it in a place where I can use a little bit less rules to that kind of stuff. What would you say to one of your old judo buddies who was no longer training judo but and apprehensive about starting jiu-jitsu but wanting to find an outlet 
to continue grappling. Don't do it. It'll take over your life. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be there every day. <laughs> Drag them out here. Chances are, if they like grappling in the first place, they'll, they'll like it at jujitsu. Cool. He's running out of questions. Up. Go on.